Hey heroes, Isaac Zephyr here, and welcome back to Sky Factory. When last we left off, we made this portal, but we couldn't get it to open because we didn't have enough mana. And I've made a few slight changes. I added some mana stars to these so we can always see whether they're gaining or losing because I want to see how viable it's going to be to keep this portal open. Um, also, the mana pools, these weren't filled entirely with my experience. I actually had one of these and I went and grabbed the mana that we had stored back in the um, in Vale. So yeah, those slime plants finally came in handy. But these are basically full, so I'm guessing we have enough. And I'm going to open this up, hopefully, finally. It's looking good, it's looking good. How much mana is that taking? Looks like quite a bit. According to these, we're still gaining mana, so that's a plus. I'm guessing that's open. Hey! Elvengard. Shit. I hope that that got my audio from the beginning. Did it? Yeah, okay, I think it did. I forgot to actually plug my headphones in. Whoopsie! Alright, so we have Elvengard. Greetings. We noticed that our portal was opened via a link from another world. That's rather shocking news indeed. We thank you very much for providing us with the represent of the knowledge from your world. As to keep... As update on what happened since we left it, it's been a while since then, it's good to see it's doing well. After some discussion with the High Council of Elvengard, we've decided to cooperate with you. You see, reading through your Lexco Botania has shown us a good amount of resources from your that we would be extremely keen as to get our hands on, as these are non-existent in our lands. The link you have managed to establish is rather weak, no living beings will be able to go through, as you already know. However, there is a positive side to this, the link strikes the fabric of time of both our worlds in a way where it doesn't keep them in sync. That's the reason why you received our book back so quickly. When it comes to mana and other magical energies, we are plenty stocked on them. So worry not about the portal closing on our end. Let's put this in prospect. In order for the advance of both our civilizations, we vow to accept a given set of resources from your world we lack in ours in exchange for resources you lack in yours. Taking the liberty of assigning our best scribes to put together a great set of knowledge from our world we're willing to share. You can find it in your lexicon just as you would find knowledge from yours. We hope you find it enlightening and that it encourages you to invest in our materials. Uh, yeah, that's red. Okay. If I stand here, though... Cool. So, me standing here and providing an experience is more than enough to actually keep this portal open. So, so long as I just stand here and provide it levels every now and again, it should be pretty good. I mean, it's got quite the store right now to deal with, but let's keep reading. Uh... Ch -ch -ch -ch. Last but not least, do keep in mind that if you decide to send something we have not vouched to trade for, we will assume it is a gift and keep it for ourselves. Just as a forewarning, we look forward to exchange resources with you. Okay, cool. So, I assume all this green stuff is new elven stuff. So let's go to basics and mechanics. Nothing. Mana manipulation, elven mana lenses, and mana spreaders. Ooh. Pretty. Mana prisms, spark augmentations... Spark Tinkerers, uh, Flora, Dandelifian, Kirkamus. So we got new generating flowers. Uh, functional flowers, I wasn't really using much of them anyway, but Bubbles, some Dream, Ore Child, Ignum. Uh, ch -ch -ch. Hmm. Oh, crazy. All sorts of nonsense. I didn't even figure out how to make a lot of the stuff we had. Okay. Natural stuff, brew incenses, open crates, brewing flasks, conjuring with mana. Alright. Drum of gathering, spectral rail. I'm looking though for lens clip, elementium, extrapolated bucket. What's this thing? Uh. Hmm. Great cleanup tool. Okay. Uh, a lot of Bifrost, the Highlands, Shaded Mesa, Slime in a Bottle, Timeless Ivy, a World Seed, Bobbles and Accessories, Various Charms, Bands of Stuff, Rings of 
Ugh. I wish I had like more time to just read this. Uh, corporeal stuff, ender, decorative end blocks, extracting ender air, force relay, the star caller, and the thunder caller. Hmm. The resources of Alfheim, the ritual of Gaia. Yeah, it was the only way to acquire Gaia spirits. These are essence Gaia herself. This ritual required an active beacon with some Gaia pylons. Read on. One level above the beacon as an altar is single. Tersi eating as a sacrifice. Okay. So then this. Uh, Guardian of Gaia. Oh, this is a fight? Handful of Spirits of Gaia. And if I'm correct, which I'm pretty sure I am, uh, this is basically full. Spirit. Yeah, these Gaia spirits, Spirit of Gaia, are what we need for our end portal frame. Yep. Oh, so it's a boss fight. <laughs> oh, crap. Well, I had best get started on that kind of stuff, I suppose. If we need a beacon, we need a beacon. So I'm going to leave that portal open. It's got plenty of mana for the meantime. I need to go grab some Wither Skeleton Skulls, because we need a Nether Star, and I don't think I have one right now. Okay. Well, I'm suddenly more excited about our botanical gardens. Ugh. <laughs> oh. Alright, so let's head... Do I have another star? From my last nether fight? I do! Yay! I don't have to fight a wither today. But do I want to fight a wither today? That is the question. Uh, bu -bu 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 -bum. I wonder if we can cheat this boss out too, but all things considering, we're pretty powerful. I could probably take it. Probably. Somebody who's done this already is probably going to be like, No, don't do it, guy is insane! She'll eat you, then kill you! Okay, let's make a beacon. Which I think is like this. It's been a while. Whoop. Beacon! A. Alright. Now this is a boss fight. I'm scared. <laughs> I'm very scared. Uh, and I'm scared because it's a boss fight and unlike the Wither, I don't know nothing about it, so I can't cheap it out in any sort of way, which means I'll have to actually fight it. What if it, like, destroys land or is, like, 200 feet tall and... The list of potentially scary things goes on. Yeah, Alright, though. I digress. Just gonna stand here. Oh, yeah, this takes like nothing. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. Staying away from purple might be a good idea. So that's how we get that. Resources of Alfheim. Dreamwood, Elementium, Pixie Dust, or Dragonstone. Uh, da -da 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 -da. So, you will give me Living Wood for Dreamwood. Decorative Blocks, blah blah blah, Dreamwood Tweaks. So any two Mana Steel for one Elementium, that's not terrible. And Pearls for Pixie Dust. Uh, diamond for Dragonstones. Alright, uh, quartz for elven quartz. Uh, ch -ch -ch -ch. Glass for elf glass. Uh, it's rather light, its patterns are randomized depending on where it's placed. Ooh. So that's mana glass. Which I think for mana glass I just, yeah, toss glass in a mana pool. Alright. This doesn't seem so hard. 
Now I think though, you can get better spreaders. So I'm going to trade all this living wood in. I better get 54 back. Thank you. Now I think... Yeah, you can make this into stairs, obviously. Elven mana spreaders. They require elementium. Dang. Now I think they're slightly better. Let me read up on them. Uh, don't. Mana manipulation. Elven mana spreaders. Conduct mana better, add some adjustments like using elementum instead of gold, which you get as a mana spreader that can conduct more mana faster and for more time without mana loss. And then it can't be turned into a pulse mana spreader, which I'm not using anyway. Gaia spirit and dragon sword. Gaia mana spreader? Uh, more potent variants. Then the top percentage of miniatures, pretty much all upgrades. Larger payload at once and thus might fire less often. Conduct more mana, faster, and for more time without mana loss. Alright. So let me try this. Alright, I need... I want some Gaia ingots, so... Give me some of that sweet Elementium, if you could, boys. And I will gladly provide you with mana steel. So I'm gonna get like 10 from this, right? Thank you, boys. Oh, did I get something else? Huh. Thank you, boys. All right. Well, actually, there could be girls. All the elves could be girls. I don't know. I don't know anything about their society other than they want me to keep this portal open. Uh, da -da 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 -da. So let's go with Elementium. I'm gonna make. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. I'm going to basically replace all of my current spreaders with these other ones. So I see 33 gray. Dude. So then I'm going to have to do all these up. But if they lose less, that is good. So I'm going to put an elven mana spreader here. And that, I want to do that, 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 ooh, the man is pink. Cool. All right. So it's Elven Mana Spreader. Connect these Endo Flames to it. Because I can. And what'll I do with these other mana spreaders? Hmm. I don't know yet. I guess I could turn them into pulse ones later. There we are. And if these lose less mana overall, then they'll keep the portal open better. Look at that! Well, they're filling fairly quickly. Alright. What other cool things do we have here? That's an even better one. Uh, da -da 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 -da. What elven lenses are there? Paint slinger lens. Something about stained glass. Paint slinger. Warp lens. Redirective, celebratory, uh, something about colors, flares. All right, nothing interesting. Those are all just pretty. Uh, da -da 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 -da. What's this thing? Flower not recommended. Those things. possibly the strongest available generating flower within the buttons is also one of the less straightforward to put to work. Cellular Conway what? Mm 
What? Something about pistons? What? What? I don't even. It requires a guy of spirit anyway. Uh, cake is delicious. So this one needs cake. Cool. Uh, now once upon a time, peasants of a nation found planting enormous dens, fields of day blooms, nightshades, yada yada. Yes, free intake of mana, various elements, happy with their ignorance. Woke, withered away, dead bushes. Men, women, and nation, passive flowers are useless now. Soon, sages rest with fire that make use of these, so said. Uh, ch -ch -ch. Any nearby, place on the floor and destroy them, creating mana. Okay. Neat. Uh, ch -ch -ch types of wool? Cool. Alright, so th none of those are particularly interesting. Uh, you know, nothing's really particularly interesting. <laughs> I'm not too sold on a lot of this elven stuff other than the Gaia Spirit thing that I need to work on. <laughs> uh, but hey, better spreaders. That's basically full. I'm gonna leave this for a bit. But hey, our place is starting to shape up and I'm enjoying it. Alright, so this is still gathering mana. It's kind of my source for if I want to make Terra Steel. What cow are you? Don't need another Pyrothium cow. Don't need a Myelin cow. I already got like two. Maybe just one. Probably two. Sludge cow, bye. Enderium cow, bye. And, ooh, nether quartz. I'll take that. You know what? I'm going to trade this for elven quartz just to see what the recipes are with it. Get out of here! Cool. Thank you! What are the uses on this? Block of elven quartz. A flugel tiara. Uh, wings of Sylph? What? It's a flight tiara. Couple of in the amulet slot. Huh. Well, this shit's useless. <laughs> Are there any uses for this? Stairs. And types of bricks. Well, I know how to make these catalysts now. Is there a page that had those on it? Like, did I miss that and that was why I couldn't find it? Uh, natural apparatuses. Alchemizing, brewing flasks, conjuring. Okay, the conjuring was the one that they don't have. So how does this work? Volatile substance, point complete properties, yada yada yada. Alchemy catalyst, mixture of the mule, but of the mana pool. Uh, to the bottom of a mana pool enables the pool to perform alchemy. So, if I place an alchemy catalyst underneath a mana pool, said mana pool can turn one item into a different item? Which is cool. Which also allows me to undo some stuff, which is nice at the cost of mana. Okay. And what's the conjuring? Magic materializing resources from magical energy only. Works similar to the tosses an item into the pool with the catalyst below. So this multiplies objects. So one redstone into two, quartz, coal, snow, netherrack. Alright. Shift click. I need pixie dust, three elementium. I need to make the alchemy. Damn it. You always gotta make everything hard, don't you, Botania? Don't ya? You just bleed the experience out of me. Those are full. I, like, never need to do that again. <laughs> I guess whenever I'm making flowers, it'll provide it with material, so... Ah. Alright. What do we need for this? Two gold, some brewing stands, and that. Alright, fine. I don't have the gold on me. Ugh, let's fly to the power works, get some gold. But, hey, Botania is shaping up. 
Let's make this duplication catalyst because it may be useful in the future. If only for duplicating, like, redstone. Whoa. Hello. We are having issues. I wonder if you can duplicate, like, diamonds and stuff. That'd be cool. You know, I don't really need this elven quartz. I'm going to toss it off this cliff. Because <laughs> it's green, but that's it. Uh, dunce. I need two gold. And I need to make brewing stands. Which is simple enough. Uh, fly over to Island Prime. Actually, speaking of Island Prime, I wonder how close I am to that octopal cobblestone. Because that's a project that's been going for a while. Actually, you know what? I probably have a lot of projects that are completed. So, I'm going to make this alchemy catalyst and the other thing next time. Yeah, won't hurt. Uh, we have four of the septuple. So, A, hey, we're almost there. So, let's see. We've done everything prior to here. We can't craft Zavikio Infuse because it doesn't exist anymore. Uh, we haven't planted flowers and biomes. We don't have five blaze spawners yet. We haven't troubled the end. We haven't killed the dragon or hatched an egg. Uh, I don't have used energy conduits yet. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Haven't done those. Uh, I want to make that soon. Ender quarry. Uh, maximum size reactors. I'm making way more than a thousand RF per tick, but I don't think quite ten thousand yet. Uh, da -da 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 -da. So that's how you make a thaumonomicon. I haven't really done any of the Thaumcraft stuff yet. Primordial Pearl, Eldritch Dimension stuff. We created the portal. And we need to make that. So A. Complete our Ritual of Gaia or N2. Age of the Witch, I don't think we've done anything yet. Dragon shit. Insanity shit. Uh, t -t 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 -t. Fill one chunk with cobble. 20 different crops. See, I don't like those stations, though. Because I have to refill them with fucking hose. Drives me up the wall. 20 different crops, though. Hmm. I guess I can make that work. Uh, ch -ch -ch. I have automated milking. I don't have 20 move fluid cows. Because they got to be different cows, and half of them are freaking useless to me right now. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. Max size diamond blocks. And your quarry crap. Uh, I think that's about it. Yeah, well, anyway, we've now jumped forward in Botania. We have a lot more options available. I gotta keep working on diamond plants, because if we're going to need mana diamonds for stuff, that's yet another use of diamonds that I don't have. But, till next time, this will be Isaac Zephyr signing out. Ah, Trying to figure out some things, and I'll see you all later, heroes.